This Saturday, the Tribe hosted the Virginia State Open for Men's Gymnastics. The Tribe improved on their Navy Open scores from earlier this semester. Kids, don't try this at home. Here's Daniel Depo Potemski on the pommel horse. Not a real horse, of course. Of course. However, Potemski did dominate the day, winning four of the six events, including the rings. Takes a lot of chalk. Yeah, LeBron just throws his away. Matt Burns captured the floor. And our hearts. With his acrobatic routine showcasing some of the skills that make Tribe Gymnastics number 17 in the country. Finally, Chris Yeager rounded out the day with a win on the high bar, but it was Depot's all-around performance that earned him top honors at the event. Last Thursday, the Tribe faced off at home against the Drexel Dragons and their animated coach, Bruiser Flint. Bruiser's a Tribe fan favorite, best known for his questionable fashion choices and his inability to stay off the court. Tribe captain and Lowe's senior class award finalist Quinn McDowell hits a three from range. Later, freshman guard Marcus Thornton pump fakes a Drexel defender into the air and drove to the lane, basket, and won. Thornton has been one of the biggest bright spots in the disappointing Tribe season. No confirmation yet of Coach Shaver's controversial recruiting strategy to simply clone Marcus for the years to come. Final score in this one, Drexel 64, William Mary 48. The Tribe also dropped the hard-fought contest to VCU Wednesday evening, 87-78, despite Marcus Thornton's 28-point night. Turning over to the women's side now, the Tribe earned their first win against the Lady Monarchs since 1975. Yeah, Jaws was still in theaters. Did you know that Spielberg named the shark after his lawyer? I did not. Back to game action, early in the second half, with the Tribe trailing by eight, Caitlin Matthew knocks down a three in transition to close the margin. Gerald Ford was still president. Later, down 11, Janine Automatic Aldridge sparked a comeback with her impressive fake and finish at the basket. Bush Gardens opened that year. Finally, down the stretch with the Tribe up one, Taisha Pye, that is my favorite flavor, leads the break, count the basket and the foul. This gave the Tribe a decisive four point lead. Final score for the tri game, Tribe 83, ODU 80. Any guesses on the number one song from 1975? It was pop anthem and personal favorite, Love Will Keep Us Together by Captain and Tennille. Thanks for watching. Tune in next week.